Hi ho, Couch Pumpkins. Mark Ollie here, and tonight we're up in the attic for a trip down memory lane. Talk about your long and winding road. Watch it, mister, or you'll be the walrus. Cuckoo ka choo We're back, Bravehearts. And you know, one of the best things about exploring an old attic like this are all the memories that come flooding back. Well, look, Hans. It's your old T-ball trophy. <laughs> Unfortunately, one of the worst things about an old attic is all the dust. Here, blow. And again. We'll be right back. Well, back in the attic, Bravehearts. Let's see what else we can turn up. Oh, look, Hans. It's a box of your old games. You got marbles in here and tiddlywinks. Oh, and yo-yo. What? Let me see. Oh, my. What's that? Box of old love letters. Oh, who the thunk? Not so fast, mister. They're addressed to you. Fifi. Hans. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank Hans for discovering this wonderful little treasure trove of letters from a love long gone by. Wendell, shall I share with our guests? I really don't think that's such a good idea. Well, there's only one way to stop me. How's that? Fetch, boy. Oh, that's not fair. We're back, Bravehearts, and I'm giving Wendell just five more seconds to come down and get his juicy love letters before I start sharing them. My contract specifically says no on-camera appearances. Five. Don't do this. Four. This isn't funny. Three. All right, you asked for it. Two. I tried to warn you. One. All right, gimme. Wendell, you broke the camera. I told you it wasn't a good idea. Hans, hurry up, we're on. There, that's better. All right, it works, leave it alone. You know, it's so helpful to have a good handyman when things get broken. Thank you, Hans. Now I owe someone an apology. I should say so. Right. Hans, I'm sorry Wendell is so... <clears throat> Just kidding, Wendell. Sorry. Apology accepted. You know, we may pick at one another during the show, but after the studio lights go down, I make his life a living hell. We're back in search of memories, brave hearts. And Hans, as long as we're up here, why don't you check the smoke detector? Now let's see. Got some of my old LPs. My 8-track tapes. Oh, and my Betamax VCR. You know, some technology is just doomed from the beginning. Smoke! 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 Smoke detector checks out just fine. Some technology will last forever. Well, we'll be back. Well, still up in the attic, Couch Pumpkins. Oh, I didn't realize I still had that. What is it? It's a walking cane from one of my early courtiers. It was a blind date, as I recall. He'd have to be. You don't take such a good picture yourself. Well, it looks like we've come down to the end of another one, Brave Hearts. Hans, I want you to get the dust buster and clean up around in here. All this dust flying around could set off the smoke detector. Smoke! 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 See what I mean? You should hear the burglar alarm. Good night. Smoke! 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 Nightmare shapes that crawl or glide, things that slither from the other side, 
Late night comes on shadowed wings, creature features on a silver screen, creepy crawlies, creeping dead. In your closet or beneath your bed, goblin scaper, magic reigns. Listen, brave hearts, I'll explain. Wolfman Wimple mans the mic, Fred's the sort of pet I like. Handy Hans helps with my schemes, and every night's another Halloween. I'm Mark Alley, I'm in charge here, just your sorceress at large, dear. Couch pumpkins, you're in my power, so begins the watching hour. Ooh. Help! We're being robbed!